Hello ladies and gentlemen, my name is the Face Tigerist and welcome back to Hogwarts Legacy. In the last episode we were battling a bunch of toads. So that's something that has happened. Uh, the river turned green for some reason. Perhaps it recognizes me as Slytherin. I have no idea what's actually going on anymore, but I'm having fun. That's all that matters in the end. Okay. So here is that grotto. That looks like an octopus sort of thing. Why would I need a piece of toast? I suppose that's where it goes. That's extremely weird. Oh. That's actually a very specific, very specific Rebellion. thing. Could it be a visitor? Oh, ah. Ooh. <laughs> mm -hmm. the name's Richard Jackdaw. I was a student just like you about a century ago. How in the world did you find this place? A house elf named Scrope sent me. Said I might find a black family ring here. Ah. Okay. Sorry to say I sold the ring a long time ago. Poor Scrope. Still holds a candle for Apollonia, I reckon. Can't say I blame him. I stole all these treasures just to impress her. Alas, it was to no avail. I thought a secret map I pilfered from Peeves would pique her interest. But she simply rolled her eyes. What would I want with yellowed old pages torn from a book? Not my finest moment. May I have them? I'd like to have those pages if you don't mind. They're not here. I thought if Apollonia wasn't interested in the map on the pages, perhaps it would lead to something that would intrigue her. So, I followed the map to what I can only describe as an enchanted cave of some kind. And you see what happened next. <laughs> Here's an idea. Why don't you meet me at the edge of the Forbidden Forest, and I'll show you where to find the pages. Uh, why the toast? Why did I need the toast to get in here? Oh, that was Apollonia's idea. Seems some squids love toast. They should have taught you that at Hogwarts. Uh, I'll see you at the forest. That's the only way for me to get those pages. I'll meet you at the forest. I'm sure the pages are still tucked in my waistcoat. If you don't mind the sight of a, well, my decapitated skeleton, they're yours for the taking. Okay, great. Thank you so much for that. There's quite literally nothing in here. Okay. Over a bridge. Then some candles. Hmm, a map. It doesn't appear to be connected to the missing pages. Best hang on to it for now. Okay. Return to scrope. I'm gonna fast travel there. Yeah, let's go here. Okay, so we'll be entering the Forbidden Forest. That's very exciting. Why was it forbidden? Okay, hold on. Map portrays a forest, bridge, and candles. I've put into my map. Use the map with floating candles to find the treasure. Okay. So, yeah, that's not this bridge. Uh, the bridge was way too little. I don't know. I guess we shall see. We shall see. Um, it could be that one from in Hogsmeade. Or it could be near the Forbidden Forest. Where we actually have to go. That would make sense. So, yeah. Hello. 
Hello, Scrope. Thanks to you, I was able to enter Apollonia's grotto. The toast was the key. I met a ghost there, Richard Jackdaw, who's agreed to lead me to the pages I've been looking for. Oh, that boy was never good enough for Apollonia. Oh, what of the Black Family ring? I'm sorry to say that Jackdaw sold it long ago. Sad news indeed. Scrope shall need to think of another way to impress that mm -hmm. monster. Scrope takes some consolation in knowing that the young Slytherin found what they needed. I did. Thank you again, Scrope. You're a credit to house elves. Okay. I guess we're off to the Forbidden Forest then. Will it marked? Of course not. Forest bridge and candles. Okay, Jack does rest. Whoa, that's all the way over there. Like that's. Yeah, that's really far off. Perhaps this is the bridge. Yeah, that this could be that bridge. Okay, uh, Hogsworth map. So I'm going to need to ooh, 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 go Summoner Court. Okay, let's go there. Hey, if it's a side quest, it's a side quest. I don't mind it. Especially if I get some XP, you know? Okay, so. Okay. I want to head on over there. So that's over here. Revelio. Oh no, it's this. No, no. What are you doing out here? Challenging you to a game of Summoner's Court. I think it's time you faced a real opponent. Outside of Ronan's little lesson in charms class. Summoner's Court isn't just a game. It's a battle of skill. <sighs> Test of a witch or wizard's metal. What say? Very well. I'm in. Let's do it. Brilliant. Summoner's Court, the ever-changing game. <laughs> can I move it all? I can. All in the wrist. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Accio. Well, it's 20 points. Try to beat that. I can't, you're going to win. Eh, lucky shot. Akio. Mm -hmm. Does that move up my score? Well, it doesn't really matter now, does it? God damn it, it comes to a crawling halt. I'll let you have that one. Wait, did I win? I won! Yes, yes you did. I shall make a mental note. <laughs> we should have bet a few galleons on that round. Care to go again? No. Another time, perhaps. Can't say I blame you. Perhaps come back when you're a bit more prepared to beat someone of my skill. Alavada <laughs> Kedavriu. Incendio. Motherfucker. Okay. How about you fucking duel me, you little bitch? 
No, he wants to play fucking bowling or Revenue. whatever the fuck that was. Fucking idiotic, if you ask me. In any case, let me let me take a look at the map. Right. Let's go. I need to head on over that bridge. Okay. Yeah, this looks like it. Okay, hold on. Not that. Quests. Okay, how do I see that? Um... Guess I can't. Rebellion. Virgin candles are put into my bag for reference. How the hell do it? Collections, want handles, conjurations, ingredients, value, enemies, tools. Use the map of floating candles to find the treasure. Aha. Uh -huh. Outpost. Okay. Inventory. Right, he did put it in the inventory. Mm hmm. Ah, quest items. There we go. Yeah, it's l quite literally some candles. There is a forest. The hell was that? Bitch. Okay, nice. Revelio. Okay, yeah, that looks like a forest. Yeah, that's one of Merlin's trials. These look like candles. But there's an awful lot of them, so I'm guessing that's not it. Bam. There you go. You're the little sod that saved them. There you are. Perfect. It's shameful what you've done to helpless beasts. Yes, it is indeed. Rebellion. Okay, give me that. I don't mind killing a bunch of poachers, you know. Rebellion. It makes me feel better. In all honesty. What the hell? Mm. 